For decades, this was one of the strangest sights in Stanley Park. Four polar bears brought to Vancouver in 1962, part of the park zoo. As attitudes towards animals in captivity changed, it was shut down. But the enclosure remains, empty since then, littered with garbage and graffiti to the confusion of tourists. Yeah, well, it's sad to be empty like that instead of having yeah. something. Use it for something. And now a local architect firm is proposing just that. So we're imagining going into a wood-fired sauna on the far side and then coming out into a cold planchier in the same place where your parents might have seen a polar bear diving. Osborne's firm has put forward a detailed design for a Nordic-style sauna with different pools, a steam room, and underground areas to relax. On the surface, it might seem like a stretch, but Osborne says it's meant to be a conversation starter. Vancouver is all too familiar with the experience of having structures demolished and just replaced with something brand new. Uh, I think it's much more interesting uh, and a much better uh, cultural practice to retain some sense of history in the past and to integrate what's new into that. The structure is under the Vancouver Park Board's control, and its chair isn't chilly to the conversation. I would love to see this come forward as a serious proposal to the board. I always want to see areas where we can reimagine, repurpose and provide more services for people that come and enjoy our parks and our recreational services. Still, Jensen says there are more than a few question marks. The cost is a big one. But so too is the Park Board's commitment to make any changes to Stanley Park in consultation with local First Nations, who have a history with the site that long precedes the polar bears. That would be step one into ensuring that the respect for Stanley Park is maintained in any sort of moving forward collaboration. The one thing that is for certain is that eventually the Park Board will have to decide what to do with this land that has sat vacant for more than 25 years. So the question becomes whether a sauna is the thing they want to take the plunge for. Justin McElroy, CBC News, Vancouver.